Yes, indeed. All you really need is good drugs. Yeah. Yeah. What's going on, everybody? All y'all? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Davey. You know that. I know you know that, but just in case you didn't know, or if you knew here, that's me. I teach Grateful Dead videos here every Thursday on the Toby and David channel, where I'd like you to subscribe pretty please. Hit that bell icon. If if you're feeling froggy, I mean, it's just, it's just for your benefit. I mean, it literally means nothing to me, but if you want to be notified when we drop Play Dead every Thursday at noon, or when we drop our awesome, hilarious podcast called The Drinking a Joint, that comes out every Tuesday at 8 a.m. across all platforms, YouTube included. All right. We've also got flashback flicks and a little thing called Loose Beats, where Toby gets drunk and walks you through his beat making process. Everything we do here is for your enjoyment. All right. And something else you might like to do is adorn your bodice with some of our cool merch over on tpublic.com slash user slash Toby dash Davey. That's, it'll be around my face somewhere and down in the description. If you want to go and check out some shit, we've got some Play Dead merch. We've got just straight up Toby and Davey merch. We got Drink and Enjoy merch. We got merch for all of our shit. Plus, you could have a pillow with my mugshot on it. Just saying. If you wanted that. It's cool to me. Whatever. But yeah, go check that out. Also, got a real, uh, real cool thing to show you guys right now. Uh, a friend of the channel and a friend of the show. His name is Jesse. This is his Instagram. This is some of his art. It's fucking incredible. insane he also does these crazy pins for like hats and other shit he's dead fam he's great he does all kinds of art go check out his website go check him out i'll be featuring him over the next few just because his art is so so good cool so go check him out all right this week we're learning good loving it was uh you know, the dead played it back in the 60s and the early 70s until Pigpen passed away. And then, you know, Bob took it over. And it's debatable which version you like better. I don't know. I mean, I really enjoy uh, the way Bob gets into it. But you really can't beat those old school Pigpen shows, can you? No, you can't. So, it's probably where I'm leaning to. But anyways, we're learning this one in C today. Like, I've always played it in E. And I don't know where I got that from, but the, the album version is in C. So that's what we're going to learn because I've had people jump on me before for not teaching the right chord progression. But it's they change keys around all the time. Don't fucking worry about it. Just fucking play the song. Move it around where you want to. Don't get on my nuts. I'm the one making the videos. So, yeah. <laughs> that's what you guys sound like. But not you. You're cool. You're fine. This is how your song breaks down, okay? You've got your intro, you've got your verse, you've got this pre-chorus thing, and your chorus, okay? And it is all C, F, and G, except for one D minor to G. But that's your pre-chorus, and we'll get to it. Stop rushing me, okay? I'll get there in my own time. Cool. So let's start out with that intro, shall we? Welcome to this part of the show that we call the intro. All right. So this is, uh, this is what it looks like. It's the same chords. It is C, F, and G back to F. So C, F, G, F. That's what it is. This is what it's going to sound like. Okay. So it's that, that, uh, that nice palm muted kind of picking out the, the chord. That's what it's going to sound like. So the album version, I'm pretty sure, just does it twice. So you'll get the... Pretty sure 
that's what it does. And on that second time, you get the the keyboard or the keys coming in doing the. <laughs> which is kind of what you're going to be playing over the chorus, okay? So this is what that should sound like. You get it? You get it. Okay, so how it's going to break down is you're going to use this C, okay? And you're going to bar it with your single finger like that, and then you're going to just kind of trace that chord. So you're going to go D, G, B, G, so... You're gonna do that same thing while hitting an F and then a G and then back to F. Okay, so watch what I'm doing. You get it? You kind of. Kind of pull off to the C again after that last F to just kind of start the whole thing over because you're just going up and then back down. You know what I'm saying? Up and then back down. Up and then back down. Cool. And then on that last one, so you're going to do that three times. And then on the fourth time, you're going to hit a C, F, G, F, G, F, C, F, G. And that's how you end that out. And that's your turnaround. That's your turnaround after all of the choruses back into the verses, slash, solo section, slash, whatever you want to do. Okie dokie. So let's do that turnaround again. So it's C, F, G, F, G, F, C, F, G, and you let that G ring out, okay? And you could always do this in different, so you could also do down here. Or up here. It is, it is dealer's choice, but I would suggest going for this, this middle, this mid register. So you can actually layer these higher and lower ones onto it for added emphasis. Okay. That's just my advice as a one guitar player to another guitar player. Or maybe you don't play guitar. Maybe you just watch these videos because you're a fucking weirdo. But takes all kinds, I guess. Don't look at my feet. Stop trying to look at my feet, weirdo. God. But anyways, we've got that down, so let's move into our verses, which are, guess what, the same well, thing. Let's go. All right, so for your verse, it is pretty much the same thing until you get to the doctor part, okay? So this is what it's going to sound like. I'm going to play it up until, we're going to kind of cut this thing in half, and you'll see what I'm saying. So right after the doctor part is where we're going to go into what is technically the pre-chorus, into the chorus. You'll see what I'm talking about. Okay, so I'm just going to show you what it sounds like. it before we get to the yeah yeah yes because i see that as the beginning of the pre-chorus i know it's weird i'm weird so don't fucking fault me for it just do the thing just do what i'm telling you to do and you can do it however you want okay so we're gonna break it down so uh well i was feeling you're gonna do that the same thing it is just the the intro i was feeling oh so bad you can either strum it or you can Pick it. I usually pick it. Well, I was feeling kind of bad. So I asked my family doctor about what I had. I said, now. And on that one, I said, now, doctor. So that's what you're doing. So I said, now, doctor. CFG. So CFG. CFG, what's Alan CFG? You get it. <laughs> okay, so let's move on to the intro. All right, 
pre-chorus, what it looks like, this is what it's going to sound like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's when we go into our chorus. Okay, so this is what this is what it's gonna break down like. So you do a C F C F C for your yeah yeah yeahs. So I say start in the middle here. So yeah 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 You you pick whatever. Do what you want. After your yeah yeah yeahs, we're gonna move on to that second half of the pre-chorus, which is the D minor to G, which is really the only time that the chords change up. So and it does give it a a big, a big, nice little, little punch in the gut. You know what I'm saying? So you get your yeah, 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 all I need, all I really need. Is it that nice build up? Okay. Now we're gonna bust on through to that chorus. Really get that money shot in. So your chorus is your fucking intro, but you're going to strum the chords instead of pick them, okay? So you've got your, all I need, all I really need is good loving. You got to have love, good loving. All I need is love, good loving, good loving. So it's that C, F, G, F to C again. So good loving, good loving, good loving, good love. So that turn around. And you know this already. So like you're done with good loving. You've learned good loving. I'm proud of you. Go play this song for a lady or a man or whatever you're into and get some good loving. Okay, now I'm going to lead over the chord progression a little bit just to let you know what that is going to maybe sound like if you wanted to take it that far, which I'm sure you do because you're learning jam band music. Okay, I mean, whatever. Not super impressive, but I love you guys. That's why I do this. So keep coming back. Please keep coming back. You guys mean a lot to me and to Toby. We appreciate you guys very much. Thank you for all of your support. 
your kind words keep us going. I'm not choking up right now. I'm trying to keep a burp in. I promise. But yeah, come back. Watch Play Dead. Watch A Drink and a Joint. Watch Loose Beats. Watch Flashback Flicks when they come out. Go to the Tee Public. Check out stuff. To check out Jesse's stuff. He's great. You guys are amazing. I love you guys. See you next week. Ooh, got to have a look. Yeah.